Amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, or ALS, is a death sentence. There is no cure. And until now, there was only one drug that relieved the symptoms. Well, now a new drug has been approved that offers hope, if, that is, you can get it. Do you want to go into the sun? Fang and Richard have been married for more than a decade, and together they have traveled the world. But in 2015, when Richard was suddenly clumsy, neurologists diagnosed ALS. They know the prognosis. Uh, yes. Yes, but um, what matters is how we, what we believe we can live with our life while we have the time. One thing they are doing is pushing to get the brand new drug, Radicava, more available for other ALS patients. Richard began using it a few weeks ago and notices a difference. I feel probably 50 percent less of the muscle twitching. I think that's working right now. Dr. Justin Quinn, co-director of the University of Maryland Medical Center's ALS clinic, has 100 patients, but only two are getting Radicava. The problem, it is very expensive, and so far, insurance companies are not making it easy. I would love to for more of my patients to be taking this medication. You feel hopeful about it? Absolutely, yes. Hope is something Fang and Richard cultivate. They still travel? Yes, we went to New Zealand and um, Australia earlier this year. Uh, Richard, myself, and a wheelchair. <laughs> Every day is brand new. If we live with our life with the positive attitude, and every, everything is possible. Even in the future, Richard hopes reverse the impact of ALS. That would be perfect, yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. It would be awesome. Well, Richard and Fang will be at the Canton Waterfront Sunday morning at 9 o'clock, joining hundreds of others at the Walk to Defeat ALS. They hope you'll join them and help raise money to support the patients, the families, and critical research to one day find a cure for this horrible disease.